your destination. Thanks, mister. You help me out. Mister? Howdy. All right, there. You got any business at the mine? I love a man who takes his duty seriously. Now, I'm looking for an Arthur Londonderry. I was told he works here. Londonderry? Oh, you'll want to speak to the foreman. He's down in the pit. Out of the damn way! Excuse me. Arthur London there. She here? I'm sorry, feller, but you're too late. Arthur's dead. <laughs> the man's dead. What's wrong with you? Oh boy, you can't exactly beat it out of him now, can you? <laughs> you might get something off his widow just across from Butcher's Creek, but I'd hurry. You ain't gonna be the only one a knocking. <laughs> You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Hey, I ain't the godforsaken money lender. gonna set fire to me the monsters it's okay you're all right now I 
thought I'd die with these animals. You're my savior, sir. Mrs. London Derry. <coughs> Arthur's dead. I know. I'm sorry for it. It's just we lent Arthur some money, you see, and so it was you. You son of a bitch. What do you want now? You want my boy's shoes? You want the food out of our bellies, what little there is? You want me to lie down for you? No, no. I... Arthur gave everything to pay your bills. Everything. And now there's some fellas coming to take the house. There ain't nothing left, mister. Uh, just wanted to say the debt canceled and to you know, take this it won't bring your husband back I know you need money and I don't well you're a good man I just wish you'd done it before he worked himself into the grave but you know maybe you and your friend that lent him the money could do things differently like not threaten a man. Excuse me. I'm sorry, ma'am. I really am. Hey, 
How did you get on, Mr. Morgan? Just Danny. Hmm. Just... Get up. What? Get up! What? What is wrong? Nothing's wrong. Nothing at all. What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Get your bag. Is this it? I don't understand. I ain't gonna kill you, though I probably should. You disgust me. And you shame us. If we could be shamed any more than we already are, that should do. Go! I don't understand you. What are you doing? Go and get a job! You know, they, they say the sick delude themselves. I was your friend. You and me, we ain't decent. But those folk, they was. Now here, take that. Take that and get lost. I'm leaving. What's your problem? Careful. Excuse me. One of the regulars came and said he was pulled right out of his carriage Careful by now. a thug with a pistol and dirty boots. Thanks, Mister. All right, girl. Oh, Get out of my that's way. cool. Thing is. Hey, Brother Dorgans and I were talking about you just the other day and hoping we would see you again. Well, how is Brother Dorkins? Oh, he's quite well. A little frustrated with the workings of our order. He keeps trying to be sent overseas, you know, do something with more challenge, maybe uh, be a missionary. He's a lovely man. Sure. And how are you? <laughs> Never better. Are you sure? Uh, I'm quite sure, sister. You know, a long time ago, I was like you. I very much doubt that. Oh, no, I did terrible things, awful things. And I could not stop doing terrible things because I did not believe that goodness existed. And then one day, I saw that love did exist. And ever since then, doing bad things became, well, not impossible, but pff, ridiculous. I guess I'm just hoping for a, a dignified exit. I shall pray for you. Oh, I'm not a religious man, sister. <laughs> I'm an outlaw. <laughs> oh, what fun. Religion is just a word. Hearts are rarely pure, but equally they are rarely impure either. Well, that's an interesting way of putting it. To me, God is people and people are God, so we must all do what we can. These people are starving. Go find them some food. Don't worry so much about your heart. The actions will lead, and the heart follows. I'll still think of you in very nasty terms, as you wish. Please help the poor. Uh, you know what, sister? I've got some money on me right now. You can... Buy some food with this. Oh, you're so wonderful, Mr. Morgan. No, that ain't true. <laughs> I meant wonderful, but so very frightening. Exactly. Consider your good deed done for the day. I won't subject any more benevolence. 
sister Ethel makes a fabulous stew. They will be so happy. All right, Rip Van Winkle, wake up for yourself. Thanks, man. Hell, even a blind hog finds an acorn every once in a while. <laughs> hey, you want company, boys? Sure, because I want to be pissing needles tomorrow. <laughs> This country is man unleashed. That's the thing, and it ain't my fault any more than it's anyone else. Man unleashed? Then unleash goodness. Not just hell's feeble brothers, sir. But how? I mean, all I know how to do is fight, I guess. I was set free to fight. Where's your son, Mrs. Down? Where you think. Down the mine. Until he gets sick. Which won't be long, given how hard they work him. See, Foreman don't like him, so he gets the worst of it. Maybe I could go. Well, maybe you could just leave us all alone. Maybe. Maybe you could just go fight some other battle. Oh, your mouth's a whore, and that's a goddamn fact. Hey, anybody want to get lucky tonight? Go home here with Arch. Why don't you shut up? Oh, hey, all right. Oh. <laughs> Who's this, your daddy? My daddy died. And this man, he killed him. What are you doing here? Leave the boy alone. Why'd you kill his daddy? You after his mama? <laughs> Stop bullying the boy. Get out of my business, mister. Leave the boy alone. Or what? Or I'll kill you too. You couldn't kill no one. Look at you, all ragged and sick and weak. Clear off, you goddamn hermit. Clear off! You and the horse son here. You can't even fight your own battles, Downs! Let me go! Looking for a free fuck, are you? Get off me! Hit me then! This is the last thing you'll ever hear! Take your hands off me! Go on, finish that fool! Now who's next? Let the boy go. Let him go! Come on, mate. Shame on you. He's just a goddamn boy! Let's get you out of here. But they're gonna kill me. Now I got no job, and they're gonna kill me. I've got some money. You and your mama can go someplace nice. Well, why are you doing this? I don't know. Listen, take this. All of it. Try and talk to your mama and get out of here. Now run. I'll try. Good boy. I don't want to see you here again. <laughs> 